Day nine, March 27, 2020. You know, I went outside, my, my mind was all busy and I wasn't sure what to do and what to say and I want to say my prayers and say thank you God for guiding me and I look up in the sky and there's the crescent moon and Venus and a couple of cypress trees poking up. And I, and I was just reminded of, of the inherent beauty in all of life. And then that reminded me of like, if I look at the good, I find the good. And if I look at the bad, I find the bad. It's like, remember that old story of the Indian chief and the little squaw? And she's, he tells the little squaw about the two coyotes that live inside. The good coyote and the bad coyote, and they're, they're always fighting each other. And the little squaw says, which one wins, grandfather? And grandfather says, the one you feed, granddaughter. So, yeah, the one we feed, you feed the good vision or the bad vision. And it really isn't that amazing, like, what if it's that simple of what it comes down to, what we choose to look at? So I said, well, how do we shift our thinking? How do I shift my thinking? By helping others. Like, you know, I called my beautiful friend uh, Mama Rain. She's, you know, depressed. A lot of people are depressed. And uh, I said, Reen, you have so many stories to tell. I said, this is the time. You have the time. I said, get your index cards, get your pen and a rubber band, and we're going to start telling stories. And you just put down Patty Hearst and the SLA and Sonny Barger and the Hells Angels and so on and so forth and just start making notes. I mean, there's so many opportunities. You want to help somebody? Okay, maybe you can't go over and be a good neighbor, or you could. You could pick something up at the store and take it to somebody who's uh, invalid, or you could just pick up the phone and call somebody and say, hey, I was thinking about you and wanted to let you know I love you. Lest I forget, it's the last Friday of the month, so Shabbat Shalom. You know, we started this tradition 16 months ago. Well, we didn't start the tradition. We carried it on in Snapdragon. But the monthly tradition of getting together and breaking bread and celebrating the, the life and the living spirit in each and every one of us. So it reminds me of Gandhi at that moment in the film when he says, I am Hindu, I am Muslim, I am Buddhist, I am Christian. We are all the family of man. Time to rise up, family of man. So many opportunities. The greatest seeds are planted in darkness.